Hi, I'm Drew. Welcome to the Beggar's Woodshop video podcast for this August of 2021. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. You are most welcome. Thank you for joining me here. And thank you for inviting me into your homes or laps or well, however you happen to be viewing this program. Uh, seems like every couple of months I do this. I just do it straight to the camera. No audio, no special introductions, no nothing. Uh, first is because I wanted to give you a podcast. Second, because of timing with termites and the housing or the tenting. Now it's because my computer doesn't want to work. First the sound died and then about a week later it refused to stay on. Something's going on with the power. So I am down here in front of the camera and to make it more interesting I'm by the railroad tracks. It is no secret I'm a train man. I love trains. I've always loved trains far back as I can remember and that's pretty damn far back because I was a my earliest memories are at least three years old. That's, and it's spotty at best, but trains have always been there. So, uh, that's what's going on there. So let's give you an update. Actually, before I do that, I'm letting you know, I am waiting on the California Zephyr to come through. She is running late. I'm right by the signal, so they are green. They were green and then they went off and now they're green again. That's why I'm looking back every so often. I don't want my back to be to the train when it comes through from right here. Uh, the train you're hearing now is our light rail train here in Sacramento, Regional Transit. I'm right by a, 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 an Amtrak st or, uh, a light rail station. So that's what that noise is. So let me give you an update from last month. Uh, the GoFundMe, I haven't looked, but the link is still in the description below. I may be adjusting the price, uh, but I took some money out of my savings account, set it as my budget, and then spent some money on eBay for a bandsaw and a lathe duplicator. And I was able to get some at a good price and still come in under budget. <laughs> I like it when you get a friendly engineer. Um, so that's what's going on with, with that. Uh, and I shot my videos of me unboxing them and fine-tuning them and assembling them. I have yet to do the videos where I use them. And that's because it's been too damn hot. Okay, I gotta work outside or in the garage and mostly I have to do outside because they, uh, the, the sawdust everywhere. It's a cramped garage. If you see the videos, you understand. In fact, if you see my previous podcast, you understand. Nothing yet. Um, oh, I see her coming. I see her coming. Yep. Here she is. Ooh. So let's get ready, ladies and gentlemen. Amtrak California Zephyr, train number uh, five. That's right. Five is the uh, is that one. So as I was saying, yeah, I set up the budget, got the items, working in the shop. I shot all the videos except for using them. The weather has been better. In fact, that's why I'm out here. It's better weather, and. She should be coming in the frame now. And uh, and I've also been distracted by the Olympics. But by the time this video uh, premieres on here on YouTube, the Olympics are pretty much over with the exception of closing ceremonies. And are we being led by a... F no, we're not being led by a freight. Track is she? No, she's on the main track. Well, let's take a moment of silence and holy crap, here comes an idiot who's going to probably try to cross the tracks. Yep, there he goes. He's running. Yep. Okay, ladies and germs, let me just adjust this for you. Enjoy the train for a moment. Beautiful, beautiful. 
Normally the baggage car is up by the locomotives, but due to weather issues in Colorado, they've had to turn around at Grand Junction. Uh, on the other side, they've stopped at Denver. That's what I thought. Yeah, she's switching tracks. Either way, we get ourselves a nice shot of the Zephyr. I'm going to keep talking here while she rolls off into the distance. But, um... Yeah, so I still have those to shoot. The computer issue... You know, I, I don't know what's going on. I shot some video to show what was going on, even though I described it to my friend Alan. So he's working on it, I'm working on it. Hopefully, I can get this all solved. What a beautiful sound. And it in it? Uh, but, yeah, so that's what we got going on with the Beggar's Woodshop. And she's moving a little bit slower than she normally does. I'm surprised. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I, I think that pretty much covers it. I'm trying not to let this go too long. Uh, but while this is up, I would like to say thank you to Scott from My Growth Rings. Because without his videos, ladies and gentlemen, um, I actually would have a bit of a problem missing a few things. Even though I got a manual, his videos were really helpful, especially when it came to fine-tuning that bandsaw. He hasn't done anything with the lathe duplicator. But, yeah, uh, GoFundMe link is still up, but I might be bringing down the price. Or, the final total. Mostly because we've got a few of the other items. But, ah, that's it. Items. Yes, that was the other thing I wanted to talk about. Okay, the yard sale I was gonna that we were gonna have ended up being too damn hot for my family to be out there, so we opted out. So the uh, a few of the items I wanted to sell, the bowls and the vase, vase, pencil holder thing, whatever you want to call it, is not uh, has not been sold. They've not been sold. There might be a link down below to the. Uh, to the items on eBay, okay? Um, I may have to rush that this week. Don't hold your breath. I'm using another computer to be able to check messages and upload this video. So that's what's going on there. It'd be kind of nice if we got another train coming the other direction to close out this video, but we don't. Well, we kind of do. Here comes another light rail. So that's what's going on, ladies and gentlemen, with all that. So keep your eyes open. See if that shows up. Um, although, well, he's, if there is an e eBay link in below, it's to my main eBay, not the individual item. In fact, that's probably what I'm going to do. It'll be to my eBay, not the individual item. Hello, light rail. So, uh, with that being said, like us on Facebook. Uh, subscribe here on YouTube. Like this video, comment. It helps get things going. Uh, you'll see a little bell icon. If you click on that, it will notify you with an email the moment a video is uploaded or I go live, whatever the case may be. I keep forgetting about that one, but my friend Don, who's also a train guy, he, su he subscribed and clicked the notification bell, so it reminded me to do that. Um, our GoFundMe link down below. Help, uh, help support us here at the Baker's Woodshop, and hopefully I will see you next time right here on the Baker's Woodshop.